back to our channel, it's Bella here. In today's tutorial, I created this makeup look for you guys. So if you want to see how I achieved the look, then go ahead and keep on watching. And make sure that you go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. Make sure that you are subscribed to our channel so that you never ever miss a video. So the first thing that I did was I grabbed my Huda Beauty Overachiever Concealer and I grabbed the shade Cotton Candy. And I like to use this concealer as an eyeshadow primer. So I just apply it all over my eyelid and then I blend it out with a damp beauty sponge. And then I always set everything in place with some translucent powder to make blending eyeshadows a little bit easier. The palette that I went in with is the ABH Norvina Collection Mini Pro Palette Volume 2. And this is what it looks like on the inside. This is my first time using this palette and I actually really liked it. The first shade that I went in with is this really light pink peach shade and I picked it up with a fluffy blending brush and I just put that shade in my crease just going in back and forth motions and the shade is going to act as my background shade before I go in with darker eyeshadows. So next I went in with this deeper matte brown shade and I just picked that up with a defined angled brush and I started to map out where I want to add definition in my crease and I did flick it out in the outer corner just to give it that winged eyeshadow look effect and don't worry we will blend it out so it won't look this harsh in the end and then going back into that first transition shade with a fluffy blending brush I just went over that line going in circular motions and back and forth motions just to make sure that we have the blendedness that we desire And then going back into the Huda Beauty concealer, I just started to clean up my lid and I do want it to be a little bit more crisp and sharp since it is kind of like a cut crease type of look. And then going in with this foiled green shade, I just picked that up with a flat brush and I started to apply it all over my lid. And I did find that this shade did apply really well with my finger as well, so... But sometimes I find it hard to use my fingers to apply eyeshadow because I have nails. And then I went in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Ghastly Glitter and the NYX Glitter Primer. And I just applied that over top of that green shade that we just applied. And even though it looks like a yellow glitter, it has a lot of hints of green. And it does have a green reflex almost like an iridescence to it so I find that it complemented that green shade really well for lashes I went in with our Sophie Bella lashes if you guys have always wanted to try our lashes this is like your last chance all of the lashes are marked 50% off and unfortunately we're not going to be restocking any of the styles so once it's gone it's gone forever so definitely go in the link in the description box down below I'll link all of our lashes and lastly, I went in with some lower lash mascara. I chose to leave the lower lash bare from eyeshadows. I just wanted to make the lid and the crease kind of like the highlight of the look. So if you guys enjoyed it, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye! Now where do we go from here?